Say hello to the AS5600. This sensor tracks the rotation of a tiny magnet with insane precision even beyond 360 degrees, all under three bucks. I'll show you what parts you need to get the AS5600 sensor working, how to wire it all up, and how to code it from absolute scratch so that you can start using this amazing sensor in your projects right away. The first thing we need is an AS5600 module. I bought a box of 8 units for about 20 bucks from DigiKey, which comes together with the magnets. I'll put a link in the description below, but you can also get many different varieties from Amazon. Next, you're going to need an Arduino Uno, some jumper wires for the connections, and an enclosure to hold the magnet in the right place over the sensor. Don't worry, you can download the one I've made for free by following the link on screen. Just make sure you print everything with a 0.25mm nozzle for best results. The easiest way to connect the AS5600 sensor is via the I2C protocol. So connect the SCL line of the sensor to the Arduino Uno's A5 pin, SDA to A4, GND to GND, and finally VDD to the Uno's 3.3V pin. And that's it. Now let's see how to code this thing up. Inside your Arduino IDE, go over to the library manager. Search for AS5600 and install the library by Rob Tillot. And here's the code that reads 0 to 360 degrees from the sensor. We start by creating a sensor object and then initialize serial and I2C communication in the setup function as usual. In the loop function, we read in the raw angles, convert them to degrees and print them out. Now, if you want to read below zero and beyond 360 degrees, you can also add a little bit more code to unwrap the sensor. You can download this code from the link on screen to try it yourself. Now, upload your code, open up your serial monitor and see how easy it is to read any angle with crazy precision and speed. Now you know how to use a super responsive and precise rotation sensor for your projects.